Accurate, reliable, getting the facts right. News 5 in High Definition starts right now. Kingsport Police say a man charged at officers with a big knife and they shot and wounded him. It all happened at home in the Lynn Garden area. Police were called there after reports of a disturbance. News 5's Caleb Perney has been following this story for us all day. He joins us now live from Holston Valley Hospital where the wounded man was taken. Caleb, what's the latest on this story? Yeah, Julia uh, Witt is still in the hospital behind me at this hour. We have heard nothing about his condition at this point, but what we do know is what led up to the gunfire early this morning. Officers say it was a domestic disturbance that caused them to respond to this home in the 100 block of Mullen Street. That's when officers say the situation turned dangerous. At some point during that encounter, the male subject came at officers with a knife which resulted in at least two of the officers firing shots. The man police shot was 27-year-old Andrew C. Witt of Kingsport. While he went to the hospital, no police were injured. Neighbors were caught off guard. I live on the other end of Mullins, and I come this way every day, though, so it is sort of a surprise. Another neighbor wouldn't talk on camera, but described her fear as she jumped to the floor after hearing the gunfire. Everyone we talked to were concerned about their own safety. It seems like it's getting closer to home all the time. You, know, you hear about situations like this happening all over the country and stuff, but when it happens right next door to you, you know, it just it makes you overly concerned. Kathy Ball is now watching her grandchildren more closely. You always worry about leaving them to go somewhere or whatever or for them to come to the school to play ball by themselves. Meanwhile, officers are continuing their investigation. TBI agents are in the process of collecting any relevant evidence and interviewing witnesses that may have observed the incident. Yeah, uh, charges are still content are, are still pending at this time as the investigation is continuing at this point. We'll continue to follow this story and bring you more information as it becomes available. Live tonight in Kingsport, Caleb Perney, News 5, WCYB. All right, Caleb, thank you so much.